Okay then, since uh, the last video, uh, not been doing too much, but uh, as you may remember, I uh, did a barrel clean on both me Webley and Hatson rifle uh, in preparation for the test with the Webley Acapel pellets. Well, the actual pull through that I use, I've, I've made it myself and it's pretty easy for anybody to make it's actually made out of uh, some streamer line uh, <clears throat> basically what you need to do is uh, using a standing knife you need to split it down the middle because it's, uh, it's cylindrical in shape it's uh, usually a bit awkward to get it to uh, cut straight so the easiest way to do it is to actually crush the plastic Streamer wire using a vise, like I'm going to do now, and this then allows you to do an easier cut on it. So you just give a damn good squeeze on the on the uh, vise, and you can see it's flattened the actual plastic out now. So you can cut your slit down the middle and thread your cloth through for the pull through. Uh, and all this is, it's around, I'd say about 30 inches long. Well, most ear rifles now, even if they're tuned, the barrels range between 9 inches for a short barrel, going up to 23 inches for an FAC barrel. So uh, as long as you've got enough trim a line to thread through get a hold of them pull it through you don't need more than 30 inches of uh, strimmer line so uh, basically that's uh, that's how I did the actual pull through uh, so obviously this is the second one I've done so from here you just need to cut the slit along it now it's using a scalpel or a Stanley knife, you just need to cut the slit through it. Now they are they are quite tough. But uh, it is easier if it's a flat flat line. So that's that's actually split it now and you just put your pull through through that just needs to be a bit longer there we go there so that's how you make a pull through for your rifle, cheap pull through. Trim a wire, cross the end flat, cut it with a standing knife, and there you go, a pull through. <laughs>